Hello to all, just wanted to make a little video here. Uh, this is uh, like a 58 or 59 Dodge Coronet. Uh, did a brake conversion on this thing since you can't buy a brake for it. Um, that's some uh, brake booster and master off a of 70 Plymouth Satellite <clears throat> from www.getthisbrakes.com. Uh, you can see back here how uh, it's you know higher than the hole that it goes to through the brake pedal i did have to uh shorten the little dreaded rod i came with uh and modify it to make it fit the pedal but other than that uh it's pretty straight on uh, made some new lines here uh this car had disc brakes in the front already so of course we have the proportion and valve um you know to adjust the rear brakes because the rear brakes are actually still drum um, but if you go on their website or call them you can buy this whole assembly here uh, I want to say about maybe 250 a little less than that I don't remember uh, that's a nice kit uh, got a full brake pedal doesn't go to the floor like I think they had some like pull apart Subaru brakes in here or something but you can see boom I'm pushing it hard it's you know not running right now but it's got you know power brakes now so and I adjusted the pedal all the way up so we can get the maximum stroke on it works great it's about it's hard to see from here, but it looks about three and a half inches from the floor, maybe four inches from the floor. So, uh, but yeah, just a, wanted to make a little video about this. Is I made a post on one of these groups on Facebook, and everybody was chiming in. So I figured if I do this, everybody can you know see the video and maybe it'll help them out and they'll know what parts to get uh also write uh wrote some other stuff below it uh which was the part number um and i don't know if it was the part number for that but let me see here and the part number i have wrote, written down here they had two of them was a rpb8001 and the other one was a d bmc10 and i'm not quite sure which one i got um but you can kind of look at it see it's like a matching set i tried to get it that way i know the booster is going to match the stroke of the uh with the rod inside and everything will match with the master cylinder being that they sold it together um it's for a 1970 plymouth satellite you know with b bodies uh comes with the the booster comes with the mount bracket and that rubber boot and that little clevis pin, the washer, cotter pin, all that, all the way down into where it connects to the pedal. Um, I got it from www.getdiscbrakes.com. Uh, just tell them you're ordering it for a 70 Plymouth satellite. Don't tell them that it's for, you know, something else. They might not want to sell it to you. you never know. But uh, I also put right stuff detailing on here in, in Ohio. I don't know if that's the same company or the same name, but I had it written down here in my notes when I was uh, ordering stuff. Uh, I also want to send a shout out to AAJ Brakes. The guy over there, he sells brake kits as well. Uh, he didn't sell what I needed, but he was very, very knowledgeable uh, on these Plymouth satellites and super, super nice guy, super, super helpful. Uh, guiding me through here because i'm not you know familiar with every car every make every model that i fix and restore and rebuild so uh, you know it's always a learning experience for me as well on some of these different models that i haven't worked on yet so uh, but leave a comment in the comment section below and i'll do my best to uh, answer any questions you guys might have uh one more thing this is uh, about a seven inch booster on here um and no, the pedal doesn't go to the floor or creep down to the floor. I got a good solid pedal. I can slam on the brakes. It don't lock them up, but it's it slows down seriously quick. So, um, you know, it's a big, heavy car. But, uh, yeah.
Oh, that's all I got for this video. But hit that subscribe button for more videos as I will be doing more repairs on this car in the future. Um, and hit that like button, hit that notification bell, and I'll let you know, uh, you know, when I pop up a new video. Stay tuned, buds. Later.